Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Rashi Goyal and in this video we are going to solve this cubic equation x cube minus x square minus 100 is equals to 0 and we have to find x. So let's start with the today's video solution. So first we have to take some values of x and put in this and check whether it's a solution of this equation or not. So let's start with 0. So first put x is equals to 0 and check. 0 cube is 0, minus 0 square is 0, minus 100. This gives us negative 100, not equals to 0. So it's a false. Now x is equals to 1. 1 cube is 1, 1 square is 1, negative 100. No, it's not equals to 0. So this is also false statement. Now x is equals to 2. That is 2 cube is 8, 2 square is 4, minus 100. This gives us 4 minus 100, that is negative 96, not equals to 0. So x is equals to 2 is also not the solution. Now check x is equals to 3. 3 cube is 27, minus 3 square is 9, minus 100. So 18 minus 100. This is also not equals to 0. So this is also a false statement. That's how we have to check. Now we are going to check with x is equals to 5. So 5 cube is 125. 5 square is 25 minus 100. So 125 minus 25 is 100 and 100 minus 100 is 0. So x is equals to 5 is one of the root. So x is equals to 5. So that means x minus 5 is equals to 0. Now we are going to solve this and take this equation because we get one of our root x cube minus x square minus 100 is equals to 0 and x minus 5 is one of the root. So now we are going to divide this equation with x minus 5. So x cube minus x square minus 100. First here is x and here is x cube. So first we multiply with x square. So x square with x is x cube and x square with negative 5 is negative 5 x square. Now we cancel out. Here is positive sign so we'll take negative and here is negative we'll take positive. We can cancel out this. Negative positive is negative so 1x minus plus 5x is 4x square with positive sign. What is left? Minus 100. Now here is x and here is 4x square so we multiply with 4x so 4x multiply with x minus 5 give us 4x square minus 20. x. So here yeah, negative. They are positive. You can cancel out this. So what is left? 20x minus 100. Now we multiply with 20 with x minus 5 so this give us 20x minus 100 so with plus 20 so 20x minus 100 now x minus 5 and the other solution is x square plus 4x plus 20 is equals to 0 so if from x minus 5 x is 5. Now we are going to solve this quadratic equation. That is x square plus 4x plus 20 is equals to 0. So we are going to use the quadratic formula that is x is equals to minus b plus minus square root b square minus 4ac by 2a where a is coefficient of x square, b is coefficient of x and c is the constant. So let's put the value x is equals to negative 4 plus minus under root 4 square minus 4 times 1 times 20 by 2 times 1. So x is equals to minus 4 plus minus under root 16 minus 80 by 2. 
So x is equals to minus 4 plus minus under root negative 64 by 2. So x is equals to negative 4 plus minus negative 64. We can write it as square root of 64 times square root of negative 1 by 2. So x is equals to negative 4 plus minus square root of 64 and perfect square of 8 and square root of negative 1 is equals to iota by 2. If I will take 2 common from numerator, so negative 2 plus minus 4 iota by 2, we can cancel out this. So x1 is 5 x2 is negative 2 plus 4 iota and x3 is negative 4 2 minus 4 iota. These are the three values of x. These two are imaginary values. So this gives us complex solution and this is the real solution. So we consider only real solution. So our final value of x is 5. I hope it's clear and you find it useful. So please give us a thumbs up and do subscribe to my channel. Stay tuned.